हेलो एवरीवन नमस्कार हाउ आर यू ऑल आई होप यू आर फाइन सो लेट्स सॉल्व वन मोर क्वेश्चन फ्रॉम पार्शियल डिफरेंशियल इक्वेशन इट्स एन क्वेश्चन फ्रॉम नॉन होमोजीनियस पार्शियल डिफरेंशियल इक्वेशन सो हाउ कैन यू से दिस इज नॉन होमोजीनियस बिकॉज यू कैन सी आर इज देयर व्हिच इज डेल टू जेड बाय डेल एक्स स्क्वायर टी इज देयर व्हिच इज डेल टू जेड बाय डेल वाई स्क्वायर both this term have degree 2 but p is also there whose degree is 1 and same is true for q so because degree is not same throughout so it is non homogeneous so i can write this as if i take del by del x as capital d and del by del y as d dash so i can write this as d2 Minus d dash square plus d minus d dash z equals to z. Okay, so I will have to factorize this in order to find my complementary function. So how can I do that? A square minus b square. A plus b. A minus B, and the last two term, if I take one common, I will get B minus D dash now. Uh, collectively, if I take D minus D dash common. I will get d plus d dash plus one z equals to z. Now we have two factors. Each factor will compare with d minus m d dash minus a. So if I compare the first one with uh, d minus m d dash minus a. So let's write that as m1 and a1. So m1 I am getting as one, a1 I am getting as zero. M2 I am getting as minus one, a2 I am getting as minus one. Okay. Fine. so if i write my complementary function now that will be e power a1x so e power 0 that is 1 only into f1 y plus m1x plus e power a2x f2 y plus m2x okay clear pi will be zero because rhs is zero final solution as always is z equals to cf plus pi so z equals to cf is f1 y plus x plus e power minus x f2 y minus x. that's it. so earlier it was given r minus t plus p minus q from there to del form and del by del x taking as capital d and take del by del y as d dash you reach to d and d dash form factorize this and compare each factor with d minus m d dash minus a from there you got the value of m1 m2 a1 a2 find the complementary function whose format is e power ax f 1 y plus mx okay a1 m1 you can manipulate that so particular integral was zero in this case z equals to cf plus py was our final answer i hope you learned something from this to watch my playlist on partial differential equation for more such videos thanks and have a nice day